<laughs> well, an update to this video we first showed you yesterday on Happening Now. <laughs> the stunning it. footage has some people amazed, others a little bit frightened, others with some questions about this giant alligator at a Florida nature preserve. So we wanted to talk a little bit more about this guy. I mean, he deserves it, right? I'm assuming it's a guy. We'll find out from James. James Clyde Nifong is a researcher at the University of Florida. He focuses on alligators. I'm calling him the gator guy, and we're proud to have you, James. So when you see this video of this giant alligator, what goes through your mind? Oh, well, that's not the largest alligator I've ever seen. Come on. Um, it's, probably, it's probably 11 to 12 feet, a uh, healthy old male alligator, probably 30, 40 years old. Um, but they get a lot bigger than that. Um, alligators have what's called indeterminate growth. So as long as they're alive, they'll keep on growing um, and keep on getting bigger. How dangerous is that alligator? Because part of the, the marvel of that video is seeing all the people on the side taking photos of it. Yeah, so um, those people are not in any real danger. Um, they're far enough away. Uh, you can see that alligator is just heading in one direction. It has a one-track mind. It's trying to get from where it was before to maybe a foraging ground or a basking site on the other side of that site. And um, really, you know, as long as nothing gets in its way or tries to mess it's not going to stop. It's just going to keep on going and, and not be bothered. I've seen big gators before, maybe 15, 16 feet, but this one looks particularly robust, shall we say. <laughs> like he's been dining on, I don't know, cattle or something. Uh, is this a particularly <laughs> beefy gator? Um, he's a very healthy, large male. Um, you can see by the size of his jowl, right behind the jaw. He has a lot of musculature there. Um, when they get up and stand up on all fours, they take large breaths and they're, you know, arching their back up. To, you know, so they're, they get their belly on the ground. So, you know, that may, you know, give it a look that it's bigger than it is. Um, but, you know, it's, it's a really normal-sized gator um, that you'll see down in Florida, you know, an older individual. I was a wildlife junkie as a kid and read all kinds of stuff. And I, I remember reading once that alligators can outrun a horse over short distances. This guy does not seem to be capable of outrunning a horse. <laughs> he, he might for about, you know, 10 yards. <laughs> he might come up. But, short, uh, very yeah, short distances. Yeah, very short distances. Uh, they're very explosive in their movement. And they can be very fast over very short distances. Um, being, a rep, being a reptile, they can't really breathe the same as a mammal, so they slow down over the long term. Uh, James, John is a little rough on this gator. He's called him fat and old and slow. I mean, I don't know. But what what does this sort of alligator eat? And and what give us just a quick day in the life of this guy because obviously there's plenty of time he's not caught on camera. Yeah, um, most of the yeah, I've put out, uh, cameras on alligators in the past. You know, super epic, and I look at what they do throughout their day. Um, most of the time, they're just sitting there, uh, either um, underwater or on top of or, you know, water, um, to conserve energy. And they also, you know, they're sit weight predators, so they just sit mainly and wait for something to walk by. Um, th there is a, a uh, well, a photograph I might have found somewhere in my archives. You know, the, the people filming that gator are being criticized. This is a... Well, what would you say about a father who places his son, you know, not too far away from a sizable gator to take this photo? Is this irresponsible parenting? Um, um I, I can't see the photo. Um, I would know um, the situation. I'm, I'm, I'm traveling. I'm on my phone. I see. Um, well, uh, I'm not sure how that is. Let me just say that the father who places his son, you know, not too far away from a sizable gator to take this photo? Is this irresponsible parenting? Um, I can't see the photo. Um, I would know um, the situation. I'm on my phone. Let me just say that the father who took that picture probably 10 or so years ago, mm -hmm. I mean, you have young children. Mm -hmm. The gator looked very well fed, and I don't think he was going to make a move. Your, and your boy was just fine, as we know. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Gator Guy. We'll be right back with more happening now.